Teu sin adiutorium meum intende. Domine ad adjuvandum me festina. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicuterat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. Deus qui celi lumenes, sator que lucis quo polum, paterno fultum brachio, preclera pandis dextera, aurora stellas iam tegit, rubrum sustolens gurgitem, Umectis atque flatibus, teram baptizans roribus. Iam noctis umbra linquintor, polum caligo deserit, tipus que Christi lucifer, diem sopitum suscitat. Dies dierum tu Deus, lucis que lumen ipseas, unum potens per omnia, potens in unum trinitas. Te nunc salvator que sumus, tipi que genu flectimus, Patrem cum Sancto Spiritu, totis laudantes vocibus. Amen. Create a clean heart in me, O God. Renew in me a steadfast spirit. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt, and cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done? That you may be justified when you give sentence And be without reproach when you judge O oh, see, in guilt I was born A sinner was I conceived Indeed you love truth in the heart Then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean Oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins, turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart, create for me, O oh God, Put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help. With a spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. Rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice, a contrite spirit, a humbled, contrite heart, you will not spur. 
In your goodness, show favor to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocaust offered on your altar. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Create a clean heart in me, O God, Renew in me a steadfast spirit. Rejoice, Jerusalem, for through you all men will be gathered to the Lord. Let all men speak of the Lord's majesty and sing his praises in Jerusalem. O Jerusalem, holy city, he scourged you for the works of your hands but will again pity the children of the righteous. Praise the Lord for his goodness, and bless the King of the ages, so that his tent may be rebuilt in you with joy. May he gladden within you all who were captives, all who were ravaged may he cherish within you for all generations to come. A bright light will shine to all parts of the earth, Many nations shall come to you from afar, and the inhabitants of all the limits of the earth, drawn to you by the name of the Lord God, bearing in their hands their gifts for the King of heaven. Every generation shall give joyful praise in you, and shall call you the Chosen One through all ages forever. Go then rejoice over the children of the righteous, who shall all be gathered together, and shall bless the Lord of the ages. Happy are those who love you, and happy those who rejoice in your prosperity. Happy are all the men who shall grieve over you, over all your chastisements, for they shall rejoice in you, as they behold all your joy forever. My spirit blesses the Lord, the great King. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Rejoice, Jerusalem, for through you all men will be gathered to the Lord. Zion, praise your God, who sent his word to renew the earth. Oh, praise the Lord, Jerusalem, Zion, praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates, he has blessed the children within you. He established peace on your borders. He feeds you with finest wheat. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as wool. He scatters hoarfrost like ashes. He hurls down hailstones like crumbs. The waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word and it melts them. At the breath of his mouth the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob, to Israel his laws and decrees. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Zion, praise your God, who sent his word to renew the earth. 
A reading from St. Paul's letter to the Galatians. I have been crucified with Christ, and the life I live now is not my own. Christ is living in me. I still live my human life, but it is a life of faith in the Son of God who loved me and gave himself for me. The Lord the Most High has done good things for me. In need I shall cry out to him. The Lord the Most High has has done done good good things things for me. In need I shall cry out to him. May he send his strength to rescue me. In need I shall cry out to him. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord the Most High has done good things for me. In need I shall cry out to him. Through the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers, and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham, to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Through the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us. We trust in God's concern for every person he has created and redeemed through his Son, Let us, therefore, renew our prayer to him. Fulfill the good work you have begun in us, Lord. O God of mercy, guide us toward spiritual growth. Fill our minds with thoughts of truth, justice, and love. Fulfill the good work you have begun in us, Lord. For your name's sake, do not abandon us forever and do not annul your covenant. Fulfill the good work you have begun in us, O Lord. Accept us, for our hearts are humble and our spirits contrite, and those who trust in you shall not be put to shame. Fulfill the good work you have begun in us, O Lord. You have called us to a prophetic vocation in Christ, Help us proclaim your mighty deeds. Fulfill the good work you have begun in us, Lord. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord, fill our hearts with your love, 
as morning fills the sky. By living your law, may we have your peace in this life and endless joy in the life to come. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat, et ab omni malo defendat, et ad vitam perducat eterna. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of death. Amen.